You previously attended the NCI seminar in 1992. What brings you back in 2012? Well, what brings us back in 2012 is, is just the way the whole economy's, economy's been going. You know, a lot of businesses are going out of business. A lot of clients are struggling. Uh, one thing that we want to make sure in our company is that we have as many clients as we can because because of the attrition of business out there, we have to now really ramp up our marketing program to to keep that attrition as at a low and also build up business. So what brings us back right now is to diversify our clientele, to build up uh, in in ranks and files numbers of new clients, and I believe that down the road that's going to help our company be prosperous. Tell us about your experience attending the NCI seminar in 1992 and the results the system generated for you after attending. Well, in 1992, it was kind of new for us. Uh, I actually hired a, a sales manager from Minolta Corporation. I figured I needed an outside salesperson. So me and uh, John, his name is John, we flew to Atlantic City and spent a week there and uh, the in went through the whole NCI program step by step. It was something new for accountants. Accountants don't get trained really in sales. Accountants go to accounting school and work with numbers. So we went to the program, learned all the details, followed through with each detail and each step and we were able to pick up over, course, over the course of say two and a half to three years around $700,000 of, of, of new business. Uh, so um, here we are again today uh, redoing our past steps and trying to overcome this situation America's in. So that's why we're here today and that's why we're back with NCI. What were some of the most important aspects of marketing that you learned from the seminar? I think that to sum up the most important marketing aspects were you really need to have a system. A systematic process is really key. So it starts off with appointment setters, hiring the right appointment setters, realizing that everything is a numbers game and, and just sticking with the program. Then we hired a CSR, an outside sales rep, to go meet with the appointments, understanding the, the sales techniques to increase our opportunity of closing deals. So I think all of that and the materials and the process is why we're here. And I think it's a combination of all those things is what I glean as value of attending uh, the seminar. What led you to decide to upgrade into the Plan 2 program? To upgrade into the Plan 2 program, we could have done the Plan 1 program because we've done this before, but our business is in a different situation. I personally deal with a lot of really high-end clients and I don't have the time personally to spend just working on this one project. And other key people in our, in our company that are going to be working on this project as well are, are also busy. So we felt to get this thing rocking and rolling and off the ground immediately was just bring in the NCI group and let them get all the people hired and get it going and within a short period of time we're off and running. That's why we went with the Plan 2 program. We saw the cost versus the value. We saw it as a value proposition and a cost savings proposition for our time. How has your quality of life changed in the 20 years since you first attended the NCI seminar? Well, my quality of life goes to, there's, there's a lot of things that are about a quality of life. I would have to say that I'm a very blessed person. I have a blessed family. Um, you know, getting off the financial end part of it. Uh, financially, we've done real well as a company. Uh, we've done very well as, as individuals. I try to bless my staff and maintain as many people in my company as I can. Uh, so our company's done very well. I, I can't really put it any more than we're just a blessed company. And, and I've got some great new grandchildren, so that's all that matters to me right now is spending time with my family and my grandchildren. In fact, they're here today at the seminar, all of them. How would you sum up your decision to use NCI to help you grow your practice? I think that the decision made was to go back to something that works. Not try to reinvent anything, not try to spend a lot of time on our own, um, programming things, reinventing ad work materials, you know, people People who try to do that, they fizzle out because they get too caught up in the time constraints of doing that and they're not doing their work. Then they shift back over to their work and they quit doing what they're supposed to be doing to create the cells. So 
that's why we're here. We just want to take the program that's handed to us and just run, the, run, run with it and, and just make it happen. What advice would you give to other accountants considering NCI to help them grow their practice? I think that the advice I would give other accountants would be this. Stick to, to doing what you do best. You were trained to be an accountant. You're a trained professional. You do taxes well. You do accounting well. But when you start shifting from what you do best to what you don't do best, your business is going to suffer. So I recommend using a company such as NCI to help you with your marketing program.